and we are back today with another video while i'm looking like a cheeseburger extra greasy out here my face oily as shit but today's video we are going to be doing a pack my makeup bag for my delivery room yay so according to the doctor I am do any day now. So, me and the typical person that I am, I wait to the last minute to do everything. <laughs> so, so, I wait to the last minute to do everything. So, I haven't even packed like a go bag yet. But we're gonna pack this makeup bag today. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> Priority. Yeah. So my face is real life oily, y'all. Like I can't even try to record it like this real quick. Hold on. Blotting sheets. Because y'all see my chin? Chin OC. My nose. Arrows. Okay, that looked a little bit better. So my brows was like itching me, so that's why half of it's gone. Fix it back. So we're gonna do this like a full face video without actually applying makeup. Duh. So for starters, let me fix my brow real quick because it's irritating. That's better. So it's like, what time is it, babe? Uh, 7.44. 7.44, I've had my makeup on for 12 hours. So don't look too bad for a 12 hour day, right? All right, so typically the first thing I do is, after I moisturize is I spray my face with a face setting spray. And I have like a drawer of backup stuff back here. So I'm just going to go in and grab some face setting spray. So because we're going to the hospital and our space is limited, we're going to actually... Hey, I found my Ulta bronzer. <laughs> if you guys been watching my other video, you know I've been missing this for about three days now. But, so we're going to use things that have multiple uses. So for my face setting spray, I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Photo Focus 3-in-1 Primer Water Prep Set Refresh in Cucumber because this is like the fullest one I have. <laughs> so, after I spray my face, I go in with my primer. So my primer that we're going to use is going to be uh, I know what we're gonna use. We're gonna use the Elf Mineral Infused Price Face Primer. And I have the color clear. So this is what it looks like. Because just in case we leave something, you know, you don't want to leave your good shit behind. So, take the thought out and stuff with you. So, after we prime our face, we always go in with our brow pencil. 
and that is going to be the elf brow pencil in the color neutral brown which i hope actually works i think i always get medium brown so hopefully that works and it's not too light after we do our brows we always have to go in and clean them up so we will be using the uh, let's see what i have here I always had a backup. I have the ABH concealer in the color 4.5. So, my other one is almost empty, so I'm pretty sure by the time I actually had a baby, it will be empty. So, I'm going to pack it this way with the full stuff just in case. So, I have a fresh jar. It's unopened, still clean. Of concealer. After we do our concealer, we have to prime our eyelids. So, for our primer, we're going to be using the Morphe Eyeshadow Primer. After we prime our lids, oh, we got to make sure we put a, brush, um, a sponge in there. We need stuff to set this with. So this is the LA Colors Face Sponge that I got, I think from, I think I got this from Family Dollar. I'm pretty sure I did. Now we're going to go in with an eyeshadow palette. So you want to take one palette that has multiple colors, multiple uses. So, I think I'm actually, I'm torn between this and my Morphe palette. Or, I can take my It's My Ray Ray palette. So, they all serve different functions. I could take this palette and not have to worry about a contour or a highlight or eyeshadow palettes because... It's all encompassing. Or I could take this palette because it has pretty colors like pink and purple. And it smells like chocolate. I think I'm going to take the pink and purple one. So I'm going to take the Per Festival palette. So I'm going to put that in there. After we do our eyes and stuff, we always go in with our foundation. So, foundations. Have quite a few here. Y'all see that highlight? So, I could either take the LA Colors Truly Matte Foundation, or I could take my Maybelline 24 Hour Super Safe Foundation. Then I'm going to take the LA Color one. After we do foundation, we always have to go in and set with a concealer. So, we're going to take, so I have the LA Girl Pro Conceal High Definition Concealer in the color Creamy Beige and Medium Beige. And then after you highlight, you're going to contour. So, I have the LA Colors um, Pro Conceal in the color Beautiful Bronze. Now we need setting powder. So some of these powders, I'm just going to take for the simple fact that if I leave it, I wouldn't really care. So um, this one is the Too Faced Peach Perfect Mattifying Loose Setting Powder. 
Um, I like this one, but the only thing that I don't like about it is sometimes, depending on what concealer you put on, it make your face look like it actually has a peach undertone to it. So, I don't be trying to wash my skin out too much. So, I'm going to grab that. And then, to set my actual face, I'm going to take the Maybelline Shine Free Loose Powder in the color Medium. Now we need to bronze and highlight. And I have a whole drawer for this. Dun, dun, dun. So for my highlighter, okay, so we could be economically friendly, right? And I could take one palette and have both a highlight and a contour color that will suffice for the most part. So, I am think I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit in the color Sun Dip. So, that actually gives me a contour and a highlight. And just because um, I can contour my nose with the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, matte bronzing powder in the color saddle i'm gonna throw that in there too after we set the face we have our highlight and our contour next we need blush so for my blush i'm going to go in with my all-time favorite which is the laura geller i'm gonna throw that in there now we need liquid liner, mascara, eyeliner, and a lippy. Duh. So for my liquid liner today, we are going to put in the, I have so much shizmet. It's ridiculous. Here it is. It's the architect liner. It's a long way down. So it's the Architect Slim Eyeliner. It's waterproof. So that's our liquid. Our pencil liner is going to be the Is Me New York Defining Auto Eyeliner in the color Jet Black. Mascara, we're gonna throw in the Too Faced Better Than Six. Now, lippies. You want to have something that's a neutral color, but shiny. My go-to is always the uh, Fenty Gloss Bomb. And you can get Bougie if you like. And can throw in a chocolate lip liner. So I'm gonna throw in the Mako Shayla and ColourPop BFF3. And then I'm going to grab the Mako Shayla Ultra Glossy Lip also. Just in case. You don't wanna be caught out here slipping in your delivery room. I'm just saying. So, got our face spray. I think our makeup bag is packed. Shim. Oh, we forgot lashes. Go. So, you got to throw in your lash glue. So, I'm just going to take these cute little lashes. And I'm going to need my scissors and my lash curlers. Right. 
Oops. So the um, you guys, we forgot our lip oil. Can't hydrate those lips. So our makeup bag is packed. And then we always have like extra stuff in our purse bag. So I have both my Fenty's. Another makeup Shayla, a ABH, some body spray, a chocolate liner, and some uh, Blistex. So we're going to have all of that as well. So that's going to be pretty much it for this video. I'll be doing another one within the next couple of days, packing for me and my baby girl. Um, to go to the hospital for our delivery. Uh, I still have like a couple of things I have to purchase for her. Before I can completely do that video. But I can, it, the items, the items will complete the video but it doesn't stop anything. So, for my brushes is the last thing actually. I have a travel brush kit. So, I have a travel brush kit. So, I'm actually going to wash these um, tonight. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. I think 11 is right for this one. I would have to double check, but I'm pretty sure it's 11. Um, I have a brush kit. And then, because you're never in the hospital just today, I have a uh, bottle of brush cleaner that I throw in here just to clean my brushes through the uses so now that that's packed I am actually going to go ahead and wash my face my skin looks absolutely horrible right now see it took the bun down and put it back up a whole different way um yeah so I will see you guys in the next video Make sure you hit like and subscribe. And again, thanks for watching. Bye. That, was, that didn't mean I was done with the video. He's very immature for his age. You wouldn't believe that he's almost 40. You popping your head back down here and supposed to make me feel the type of way. You almost 40 acting like that.